Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is a screencast on OpenOffice 2.x dev to create a mail merge. Uh, my basic premise here is to let the computer do it for you. I don't know what build this OpenOffice org is. It's a dev. They don't put the build information in here. It drives me nuts. Click OK and let's get started. <coughs> I've got a document uh, that I want to uh, I want to use a mail merge in and it's easy enough to start tools uh, actually I can't get there from here uh, the mail merge is right in here mail merge wizard click on that and I'll use the current document. That's fine. Next, I'm going to create a letter. You see that? And the email. There's a way of sending mass emails, spam, if you want to call it that, uh, via this interface as well. I need to investigate that more later. Click on Next. And now I'm going to select my address list. So the current address list is address list. But let's go ahead and show you how to do that. Go to Add. And then I find my folder wherever I kept it. Uh, see, I put it in my documents and go through. Find my address list, which is a simple Excel spreadsheet. Cancel. I'll use the one I've already created. And then I'm going to click OK. Now, what I want to do is match the fields. Now, this is part of the reason why I'm here. So I want to, here are the fields I need to match to, or it makes it easier to match to because I noticed when I started using this tool that it already picks up some of them if they're formatted correctly. I didn't bother to look in the help directory to see if they if there are any instructions on what the correct formatting is but uh, whatever it is we're going to go ahead and create them anyway. So here's my address list. I've already started one over here uh, but in the interest of uh, the viewers at home we'll go ahead and uh, build it so that you can watch it as well. Now, what I'm doing is adjusting all this so I can see my screen. Um, and I will squeeze this over to one side so I can make as much use of... It's very important to have a good mouse, I'll tell you that, folks. Good mouse is very important, if you, especially if you're doing a lot of moving, moving of tiles. Okay, so title... Uh, first name, last name, company name, uh, address line, address line 1, address line 2, and let's see what else do we have. Oh, uh, where to go, where to go, where to go. Where is that? There we go. Address line two. Pull that over. Pull that down so I can see city. Okay, and city. Capitalize it because it makes it, it might make the difference. State, zip, country, telephone, private. Telephone business. I wonder if it's going to have fax as well. We'll see here in a moment. Uh, email and gender. Well, I guess it could be interesting if you don't know. Okay, email address. Add address and gender. I'm going to go ahead and add uh, web as well, web address just for my own purposes. So I've created these fields. Now I'm quite happy with that. And I'll go ahead and populate it with some bogus data. Title, uh, Supreme Being, or Supreme Leader. How's that? Supreme Leader, uh, Darth Vader, uh, Lucas, Uh, enter prizes 
address uh, 345 Saber Lane. And address 2, I'll leave that. City, um, Dark Star. State, Antimatter. Zip, star date, 345. Country, uh, Interstellar. Telephone, 345, 6456. Uh, seven telephone. Okay, we'll put in some more bogus information. You can tell email address dvader at dvader at sw.com. Gender male web address uh, sw.com. Actually, we'll take it to openoffice.org. Okay, now I've got all my data in here. Let's go ahead and save that. Now, let me go back to my uh, matching fields. And let's see, I'm going, I need to go back, cancel. Let me open up my text document. Where's my new mail merge? Let's close this. And we'll close this. Okay, now I lost my mail merge. Uh, it's still running, but my document, my original document, ah, there's my original document. Okay, now let's go ahead and put some information in here. Tools, mail merge wizard. Use the current document, okay, yes, uh, next letter next select different address list uh, let's see add let me see if it's going to pull up a separate address list ah, I got sheet 2 there it is preview and it pulls them all up good close let's use that click OK uh, click OK and now it loaded it all. See that? It loaded really nicely. So click on next. And uh, this document should contain a salutation. Yes. Yes. Address list field indicating female recipient. Hmm. Don't know what that means. Okay. Not quite sure what that means. Lie in the body. Okay. Citation. Good. Next. Uh, and next. Creating documents. Don't know what it did. Save starting documents. Save starting document. Call this test. Put it on the desktop. Save. Finish. Okay, there it is. Uh, it created my letter for me. <coughs> Didn't actually write the letter for me, but it did populate the field. Let's see what it looks like. View data sources. There's my data sources. Good. Queries, tables. Address last one. Don't know why that's not showing up. Queries, tables. Click on it. Sheet one. Sheet two there it is okay so sheet two loaded um, and I don't know if I can just drag this I can I can just drag the data down um, which is nice it doesn't drag down the fields the ah that did but it's not going to populate it if I rerun it view data sources. So I turn off data sources. It doesn't change that. Um, insert fields other. See this doesn't access my data, uh, the database unless I go to database obviously. Uh, sheet 2 browse. Let's uh, cancel that. 
Sheet one, nothing there. Sheet two, address list one, address list two. Doesn't show anything in there. Database name, mail merge fields, okay. There are the mail merge fields, okay, good. Insert. Let's see, where did that insert? What did it insert? There it did. Okay, it inserted it there. If I do that, country, insert. It inserted it inside the country. Now, <clears throat> the question is, when I close, is it going to populate this? No, it's not. So there is some things that need to be learned. I need to learn about uh, the mail merge. But I just created my letter. Took me, took us so oh, about four minutes. Uh, I encourage you to take some time on your own and uh, play with creating mail merges with OpenOffice. It's fairly painless. It's been around for a while. Hope this has been useful. And again, it's been uh, OpenOffice Dev, how to create uh, mail merges. Let the computer fill in the blanks for you if you have your database. Thank you for your time and happy computing.